Gaga, greetings everyone. I pray everyone is having an amazing day. Um, I wanted to come on and share my story. Uh, this is this 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 is a real based on a real story. A couple of weeks back, I wanted to uh, go and get some hair products, so I uh, went to one of the beauty supply stores. And walking up to the store, I my eyes just caught all these images on the door, and they were laminated. I mean, when I would say. Maybe size is, uh, um, what, 16, 14 by 16. I mean, they were large size images. And they were pictures of uh, black and brown people look like me. And there were signs on there say gotcha. And, uh, you know, as if they were, I mean, just images plastered everywhere. And, um, I mean, instantly, I just, when I saw it, my spirit would not let me go in that store. And the reason why I say that is, see, in, in 1990, this is true too, God ordained a black man, Professor Gabriel Aldo Yibo, with the IQ of infinity. And black people, them, them same black and brown people who were the images I saw on, that, on, that, on those posters, all I could see was infinity IQ, the same genes. That's what I saw. And I know that uh, of myself, you know. Uh, I want you to Google. Go on to Google and, and, and type in the word G-A-G-U-T and start reading about Gaga. Um, there's testimonies on there, and as you scroll, you'll begin to see uh, lectures uh, on the YouTube channel called OFAPIT Institute. Uh, those are those people and and also with the background in hair um, in the early 1900s Madam CJ Walker God gave her a vision for a straightening comb the exact way to to uh, design it to um, help to uh, manage manage black hair and, and beautify it and also other products a product he gave God gave uh, revealed to her to help to soften the hair, or not soften it, but help it make make it more manageable and you know able to uh, be more creative with uh, you know designing it and, and 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 styling it and to just bring out more more added more added beauty to uh, the black people. But uh, and and at that time in history, uh, just Google her name or what I'll do. I'll have a link in the description of her biography. Madam C.J. Walker and Annie Malone. There's a website. No, it's a website. It's a blog called um, aplacevalue.net. I'm going to have that in there too. There's a story where it goes into the hair industry and it talks about at a time in this country to where um, like Black Wall Street, the wealth there, just about, there was beauty salons there, barber shops there. You had blacks that were chemists who were making hair products in, um, in labs. Uh, you had um, uh, Dudley, uh, Mr. Dudley, who had made their own hair care products. And the story in the documentary of hair talks about, you'll see it when you click on the uh, link below. Look in the link below where they talked, there were some uh, Africans that talked about being befriended by some foreigners to put their products on their shelves. And shortly after uh, having their products on their shelves, how all of a sudden their products were not um, being, you know, uh, wanted by the by the public. So you have to just, you know, pay attention to what's going on. But you know, that that's who these people are. And I'm gonna share this document right here uh, with you. This is a news coverage, and I'm gonna try to put it up really close here so you can see it. I'm not gonna hold it long because I'm gonna read it, and I want to go through it fairly uh, quickly and I'll have a on the bottom uh, below also there will be a Gogget OFAP at blogspot.com and you'll see you'll be able to see this document in there and I'm going to read it to you because this is who who these black and brown people are here's another item too I'm going to share with you really quick and then I'll um, I'll read this um, to you but there's look at the stamp mathematical genius 
GIJ comma J equals zero because A to sub N equals G sub N J times X sub J to the N plus one power. That is the IQ of this black man right here, Professor Gabriel Aldo Yibo. This is those people's uncle and cousin. But here's what the, this is the, by, it's a news article. And this was uh, written, uh, the date on here is October 2nd, 2006. And it says, People's Daily Online. It says, the heading is, Nigerian Scientist Wins African International Prize for SciTech. And it says here, it says, Nigerian scientist, Professor Gabriel Oyibo, has been named the recipient of the maiden edition of the African International Prize for Science and Technology. Announcing the award in Abuji on Saturday, Director General of the African International Foundation for Science and Technology, the abbreviations is AIFST, A-I-F-S-T, Yakubu, Yakubu, Y-A-K-U-B-U, Ugwalawo, U-G-W-O-L-A-W-O, said Oyibo was recognized for his scientific discovery. He explained that the three-time nominee for the Nobel Prize in Mathematical Physics was honored for his discovery of the 